I'm Brett, ShySky.com. Today, I'm going to show you a little trick, a little battery conversion trick that I had found. Many times we have found that we have all these NICAD batteries which come in our portable drills and things of like that and they fail us and they become no good. I had actually come up with this idea and I I'd read it at one point in time or something like that and I'm like, you know what, I'm going to improvise on it and make it a lot better little video. So what I did is I've already loosened these up. I'm going to show you the inside. It's the 14.4 port cable battery. And you can see that the top pops right off like that. That's what your battery pack looks like inside. And sometimes you'll have a dead battery um, or a dead cell in there. And that is the problem. You can't, what I call, jump start these or fix them. So you have to figure out which one is your good battery and your bad battery. What I did is this is, I took these apart and I'm going to use these batteries probably in another video on how to show you how to use the good good batteries to actually make a good flashlight functional function um, right here a little story for you is this one was actually the bad battery I tore the good one apart because I got them mixed up on accident so what I did is I'm going to take this apart just to show you is this battery tower here I replaced with a piece of PVC pipe and I cut it the same distance that it is in the tower and I put the leads on there just like that and I taped it and it slides all nice and beautifully right back up in there and then I'm going to set it right back down in here and I just used a regular wire that was laying around the shop and I'm going to reassemble this and then show you how it operates. Right, right now, what I'm going to do is I just assembled this and I drilled a, a hole in here just to run this. This works actually very nice for camping outdoors or if you're on a remote project and your battery does, does die that you can actually just hook this to your motor vehicle battery or any 12 volt battery that you actually have. And I'll show you how that actually works. I got a 12 volt battery right here on my shop floor. I'm just gonna clip, I put little clips on there. You can wrap that around or you can stuff it back into your, in your battery housing unit. And I'm gonna just put this battery back in here where I decided and got a drill bit right here. We'll see if this bad boy works. Good torque. And here you go. That's one way to actually use a bad battery. So thank you. Stay with us. We'll have more coming at you.